Okay. Yeah, for you know, I kind of like how damage. GTA tries to have a really, uh, what do you call it, serious story that? where Probably killing one birds. person is a big deal. And when you actually put a game, it's pretty much it just keeps scanning. They go out and dance, yeah. there's fucking dents on your hood from people's skulls yeah, and blood awesome. everywhere. Yeah. yeah. Just watch like, oh, hey, Nico, I like your shit. Honestly, just watch honestly, I didn't like GTA I saw it too. 4. Oh, At least I'm ruining it. Saints Row 2 is self-aware. Did you see it? Uh, no. I mean, maybe. Why would... I why would Nico's mother, mother like not even be in Nico's name if yourself? she's from Serbia? Whoa, and, which is broken. And he is You don't know Serbia. if he's from Serbia. <laughs> he's supposed to be from Serbia, and his mother don't know. probably doesn't even know oh, English. For some reason, he's from Serbia. So much better. Everybody the problem with the mall, or is it was too maybe serious. one day we'll visit somewhere like this and, and not shoot the natives. Uh, yeah, the racing, yeah. The chasing mission. Sure, we're chasing. I mean, I, I'm the beard chasing. guy that gets killed well, in the. Well, the chasing in missions were easy on the PC because you could like, actually aim and end them in about ten seconds. Most of course, they are scripted to last longer. Yeah, man, I'm playing all of the vehicle chase missions. The Saints were too artistically, but they're hard on the console. So. Hey, I'm getting sick to have on the console because, uh, just play better. Yeah, I don't know, I might too. But hey, you can get mods for Saints Row 2, can you? That's interesting. Yeah, but there aren't too many. There's Gentleman of the Row and what else? Yeah, that's still pretty cool though, but maybe not an appraisement for the overall probably better experience for the Libyan console in turn. Saints Row 2 is such a bad port, but it's still an amazingly fun game. I know, if the port's terrible, it performs terribly, the controls are not everything. that great, but it's just an awesome game. And you hear what I, you hear what I said? My boss is a guy that wears a purple suit with a cockney and all of his gang are security professionals. That's what I ended up doing too. Mine was mine. We're gonna ask you to make the ninjas follow up, but we're low on firepower. Okay, I got a bunch of kids just rushing away here for a rainy day to dig. But I'll put in the air for you. How's that? Sorry, Many thanks, Ghost Rider. Alright, let's go. Nothing like a little ambush to get the blood circulating. How's the hypertension, Sergeant? Let's just go get the goddamn supply crate before they catch up. Whoa, there's gonna be a recorded podcast, man. Yes. Well, at least, at least there's a podcast. So, yeah, uh, man. A podcast of what? The, the podcast is. Looks like some kind of the surveillance hardware. But uh, first style, so I got my shirt, and Which then shirt? Uh, my mom had to bring it. The oh, the uh, hat shirt. Oh. The one that said to the wrong address, they put a note saying, uh, Dear Dad, I'm not coming home until you respect me. Any weapons me. we find from now on, it's still pretty really funny. We can equip whatever no, we have yeah, no. from crates like this. Got it? Uh, yeah, Sarge, thanks. I'm not unfamiliar with how crates work. So you got a Medic 64 shirt right now. We got the crate. Very thanks. deep. Yes, I do. Okay, Bravo 2, that's cool. Ghost Rider out. Why can't I open this supply? Wow. Whoa. Giant white screen wow. of whiteness. Yeah. I just realized something awful. That, uh, if they do make a Battlefield 1944, it's gonna be an expansion pack because, uh, you can't tactical out with M1 Garand. You can't nice. have unlocks and shit for weapons because it's just a big Whoa, Colossus shirt was secret mystery prize. We need to keep moving if we want to find quiet. It's, it's secret and random. For so long, I love for Roger's yeah. house. Oh, it is great. Definitely. Who doesn't oh, love for Roger? They're running they found Mega 64 night time. The best is when he combines sriracha and mayonnaise. Whoa. It's mayonnaise. Whoa. Mayonnaise is so fat, babe. What's the other thing?
Man, they're at a Mega 64 night time. Wait, what? Who are you talking to, man? Actually, fucking Shiracha and Ketchup. Wow, I've been having this all at game over. Right well, in front it depends of me, what you're putting it on. I mean, if it's something that needs ketchup anyway, then Sriracha plus ketchup makes it actually good ketchup. Um, uh, on the other hand, for things where Sriracha sauce itself is great, uh, ketchup is stayed in the same place. Looks like we can't go on in the boat. Crap is ahead. Is that a lumber yard? Why am I going to go this way? Dude, no way they pull this so much over the wax. Go ahead, Maggot. Oh, no, I did. Where can I find this sriracha sauce? Uh, uh, any grocery stores? I can buy it at my local grocery store in South Dakota, so it should be able to buy it. Yeah, you can probably find it at most burger stores, but if you definitely want to get it, like an Asian grocer, you absolutely have it. Shit! But yeah, fucking sriracha mixed with ketchup on like a coca sour or a fucking grilled cheese is great. I so what's, do you think, uh, have you seen version 3 mess with people like No, I haven't even seen version 1 or 2. So I haven't seen Wow. I don't know. I'll probably buy the DVDs sometime. In summer. Don't buy version 1, that's pretty bad. Is it? Well, it's just because it's like their public access at the time. Well, hey, sometimes, uh -oh. you know, that's, that's the charming side of it. Yeah, I guess. I guess I, I think like for the special feats. I can see how they grow. I could... The special feats are oh, good. Like... You thought you could take the saints? Uh, can't wait for more saints. Man, Yellow Wolf is really fucking taking off. I, I mean, I guess it's not surprising to see the fucking white rapper get big. But... Whatever. Whenever I see Yellow somebody Wolf. wearing like a triple dress, yeah, he's some terrible sound rapper. So terrible. Sounds he's exactly like him in it too. Can I just assume that he's racist? Yes. Racist alone. Why, uh, racism mode. No, actually, he's pretty staunch anti-racist and gets really pissed off at people who are. He's done a song with you, Jimmy. That's cool. He's pretty much a racist, yeah. Dude, he looks like him, man. Jesus Christ. He's done a song with Gucci Mane, man. Confirmed racist. He doesn't look anything like Eminem, dude. Oh, maybe I just saw like one second shot of him in this video, so. Perhaps you, you are the real racist. Whoa. No, I'm not a racist. Oh, white people look the same. Hey, man, they're bald white people. They all look the same. Incoming RPG! Shit! Now it's good in this uh, room, I say. Ganto vision. God, he looks like a white supremacist. I mean, I'm, I'm never going to unmute Pro Styles, but I have the feeling he's probably saying that Yellow Wolf is inferior to Little B now or something. Okay. No. Hold the ground. He's not. He's oh. not saying anything, actually. Okay, awesome. I got a truck. I got a truck. I got one over there. And what? Get him off, oh, God. RPG. Do you think we get Okay, I like I like the fact that it was at least playing BC2. Oh. Pro Are you playing BC2? Don't play that game. What? I showed my mom the video for Yonkers. Why? God damn it! 
I don't know, I thought it would be funny, it was. I don't know why it's over such racist music. Yeah, that was a pretty good video, but... I don't know, man. Way too overplayed now. <laughs> 28 million views. I'm just probably gonna stop listening to OF. It's too mainstream. Mm hmm. Yeah, pretty much. I liked them before they were popular. <laughs> yeah, I actually did, so. <laughs> <laughs> Hasn't even heard of the Amber Cole. What? Amber Cole, so Man. the 14 year old that got caught getting head or something. So a young god did a song about how we uh yet another great left winner to Warkek, uh fuck you Warkek. Talking about OF, man. See, the funny thing is, is we talk about how evil Gaddafi is, and yet we, like, completely gloss over all of the great Gaddafi things that he did for his people. No, Saddam Hussein much, was always much. a dickhead. Gaddafi was actually probably the best leader Africa's ever seen. Keep the video mesothelium up. <clears throat> well, except for all the torture and the rape. No, it's a good song. <laughs> Uh, also, why, why are we talking about the best leader Africa's ever seen, when I wouldn't really call their, their leadership pretty stellar in general. I'd say, uh, he's pretty much the king of shit. Dude, hey, you want to move to Liberia with me? Strike aircraft to bomb cities, his own cities, it's called, uh, yeah. Should all, dude, we should have like a look, look uh, warlord group in Liberia now. Let's see you and get out of there. Just all well, once the Croatian Civil War starts, I don't know who to call. Croatian Civil War? Excuse me. I'm just coming out here with you guys. Excuse me. No, you should go. You should go hang out with Keyframe. No. Back. Separation. No. Canadian Civil War. Get in there! Whoa. I don't know, General Butt Bank, but this is pretty good, General. He just has the best name he's a like, legitimately good leader. Dude, he owns. Well, I mean, you know, no no question his name on this. Uh, but, dude, what are you questioning his comments? Hey, you know, all I gotta say is, look at the fucking school board in Libya. In his rule, Libya went from the worst shithole in Africa to a place that actually yeah. rivaled okay. a lot of European nations. What? What the fuck? Uh, the standard of living in Libya was actually better than the standard of living in some European countries. You know, all need to deal with this. They hated Gaddafi because he refused to kowtow to capitalist interests. He showed people yeah, that, that nations uh, can be free and independent. Okay. Why else so, he decides to send tanks to go uh, shell cities. Is that the, late, the laziest conclusion to draw of anything is has to do with capitalism. That's that's lazy. The CIA is staging a coup in his country. What was he supposed to do? Let, the, let it happen? It's corporatism. Well, it could I mean, happened anyway, exactly, so yeah, uh, he could have gone with a lot less confident. people dead. You don't exactly build confidence in your regime when you shell innocent civilians. I, I mean, like, how exactly? Oh, do you, you mean think like America does NATO all the fucking down? time? Oh, is, is it? I mean, we, we don't exactly build confidence in those areas, now, do we? So why why does if America does something, why does that make it okay for Libya? No one's excusing anything America did has done. It's just all literally a straw man. Put a little more. Yeah. Yes. Why would you have a man?